Hi, uh, hello everyone and uh, good afternoon. Uh, welcome to the Chance Group channel. This time we will held the online webinar. And uh, this time our technical teams will introduce the animal liver and uh, will introduce why is animal liver is so important. And uh, if the animal liver harmed, uh, you will lose uh, how much loss you will uh, how much money you will lose and uh, next uh, the, and uh, now uh, let's see our expert uh, oh. our doctor dr john dr john here hello hello everyone So this is our technical director, uh, Dr. John. Hello, everyone. So I'm uh, aquaculture expert, uh, Ben. So let's start the, the presentation. Actually, why we give this talk? Because um, actually, no, the, the liver is the most important organ for the uh, human being, also for the farming animals like the poultry. Like the uh, uh, swan and the women, of course, for agriculture, the same. Okay, let's start the topic. Hopefully, this is, uh, will be helpful for our audience. So, the first part, uh, I just like to share. I'll introduce what is a liver. What is a liver? Uh, okay, liver is the largest organ in, in the body for human beings for other animals. And uh, also the largest uh, digestive gland, which uh, like the nutrients, uh, protein, uh, lipid, also carbohydrate digested in the liver. And the weight is around two to three percent. For the adult people, maybe around 1.5 kg in terms of weight. Okay, but the string is uh, in the liver, there's no any pain nerve. So also we, we call it dumb. And uh, this size of organ have more than 500 biochemical reactions. Of course, also more than southern functions. That's why uh, until now, no any artificial organs or device. Uh, can have the capability of reproducing uh, the same function at the liver, at the liver. Okay, that's why so far no any uh, such a, such kind of artificial organs or device is capable of rep reproducing all the functions of the livers. Okay, fr from this photo we can see there is a plenty of. Uh, Regularly, the vascular system in the liver, we can see a lot of uh, uh, vessels. Of course, the blood filled out, isolated these cells into many, many layers. Later, I will show you some uh, photos. Of course, uh, when the blood um, in the digestive tract brings the nutrients from the portal vein to the preparatic soy and the nutritious liver cells. Okay, this some is uh, we can see the the vessels. Some is uh, 
uh, for the Beltar, same as the uh, portal wind. And uh, from this, this is a macro structure of uh, levers. There is a uh, plenty of uh, uh, lever lobules in the in, in the lever. Okay, this is a uh, from the screen. The, the photo we can see the lobules. Lobules. Okay. The the. This is a From the photos, we can uh, we can see a lot of vessels like the uh, portal winds, bell darts, and uh, also the arteries. Uh, for the each liver lobule contain, contains many, many uh, hepatocytes. Okay, from the photo we can see the red color is a hepatocytes. Of course, uh, there, there is also plenty of uh, copper cells, which is for the liver defensing. Later, we will give the details uh, uh, explanation. Okay, this is a, we, you can see the couple of cells. Okay, of course the bell, mm, canalicular, the, the, the tiny, tiny one brings, uh, carry all the hepatocytes uh, secretions into the bell duct. Finally, convert into the hepatopathic, uh, hepatic uh, ducts. So uh, this is the, what is the lever for the general information. Later I will invite our uh, technical director, Dr. John, to introduce uh, mean functions of the lever for the animals. Dr. John. Thank you. Uh, this part will, uh, I will talk uh, main function of lever. Uh, main function of lever. Uh, include uh, production of cholesterol, uh, storage of micronutrient, uh, blood sugar balance, uh, protecting of bile. Um, also include uh, protein synthesis, uh, immune system. Also include uh, metabolic uh, metabolism. Toxic function uh, Let me introduce uh, this function detail. Uh, the first uh, labor in point uh, metabolism. The most uh, critical aspect of point uh, metabolism that uh, occur in the labor at falling. Uh, then emanation and transamination of amino acid follow the back. And conversion of the non uh, nitrogenous part of the uh, molecules to glucose or lipids, uh, remove or emanate from the body by synthesis of urea. Synthesis of non essential amino acid. Capsules that are responsible for synthesis. Almost uh, of plasm protein. Second function is uh, uh, carbohydrate metabolism. Excess glucose entering the blood, blood after a meal is rapidly taken by the liver and as a large polymer glucogen 
uh, later when the blood concentration of glucose began to decline, the labor activities, other pathway which led to the polymerization of glycogen uh, and the export of glucose back into the blood for transport to all other tissue. Uh, the second function labor is uh, the fat metabolism. Few aspects of lipid metabolism are uniquely to the liver, but many are carried out uh, by the liver. The liver is extremely active in obtaining uh, triglyceride to produce energy. A bulk of the uh, lipoprotein are synthesized in the liver. The liver is a major site for converting excess carbohydrate and the protein into fat acid and the triglyceride, -like which are then exported and uh, stored in adipose tissue. The liver synthesizes the large quantities of cholesterol and uh, phospholipid. Uh, the first function uh, is liver detoxification. Detoxification, the liver is the body's main detoxification organ. It reduces max of uh, uh, drugs and uh, toxin and uh, metabolites in the body. It reduces the toxification of drugs and uh, and the, tox and the toxin through combined oxidation reduction and uh, hydrolysis and even break them down into uh, non-toxic compounds, which would be extracted through urine or bile. The fifth function of liver is defense, also immune function. The liver has the uh, largest number of buffer cells, uh, which has strong uh, abilities. Uh, uh, at the same time, the liver is also an important place for synthesis uh, of IgG, IgA, or IgM, and uh, complement to C3 or C4, and plays a vital role in the non special immune or animal. The sixth function of liver is biocid. Liver cells product biocid, which is transported to the global through the bile duct. Uh, the glabiter uh, concentrate and uh, discharge the bile. Bell entered the instance uh, through the bile duct, which not uh, only promotes the digestion and uh, absorption of fat in the small uh, intestine, uh, but also to accelerate the body metabolic uh, with and the foreign bodies into the uh, intents and uh, excrete the foreign bodies. Therefore, I say that is both digestive fluid and uh, uh, extraordinary uh, fluid. Okay. <laughs> so I think that's now Dr. Zhang um, deliver a lot of uh, useful information, especially for the last part for our liver and um, produce a created uh, bell acid. But for the bile acid, especially are important for the fat digestion because uh, this bile acid can has a few uh, functions in digest uh, fat, like uh, emulsion, um, promote the activity of lipids, also uh, promote the absorption of fat. Okay, later maybe I, I will give a bit uh, explanation.
Okay, let's let's move to uh, uh, causes and uh, harms of liver injury. So I mean, what what uh, re, what what kinds of uh, um, uh, causes will damage the liver? Okay, I think the first is uh, drugs. Okay, like the antibiotic. Uh, pesticides is very, very common in our daily life. And uh, especially from this February, China government totally uh, banned the uh, using of uh, antibiotics. Okay, that's why now we transfer to the some plant extract of um, some Chinese herb to control or killing uh, harmful bacteria. Another is over overfeed. So this is especially for the farming animals and also ignoring by most of the farmers because as a farmers, they want to uh, higher wolf rate. They shorten the culture period. Also keep the overfeeding. Then finally will result in the uh, damage of the liver increase the burden of the labor. Of course, another is a uh, high fat content fat. I mean, now, based on our, our experience in the past uh, 20 years, the fat content in our feed keep increasing. For example, for aqua aquatic animals, for the fish, the fat content from 5% to 6, 7, 8, until 10 even some 12 to 15. And for the salmon, I think uh, above 35%, which is uh, really high. But this also will cause the damage of uh, liver. Another is uh, for the super intensive farming uh, in the poultry, in the aquaculture. When too crowded, the too much uh, animals in the, the the small species, of course, will stress the animals. So toxin, microtoxin is very, very common, especially this year, in, in, I think in some of uh, Asia country, when we harvest the raw material like the corn, like the soya, the rainy season. So uh, a lot of, uh, I think, uh, quite uh, high percent of raw material decay and get the toxins like the aflatoxin B1. Of course, like the Vibrio, like the uh, virus also will cause the damage uh, of liver. This is a common uh, reasons for damaging or injuring the livers of animal. So once the liver injured, what will cause Okay, for in the aquaculture, this is a fish. So from the photos, we can see from left side to right side, I will uh, introduce. So the first is for the liver. If you give too much fat or, or overfeeding, definitely will damage the liver. From the first photo, we can see the liver is uh, like the rotten and uh, wet color. When you touch the texture, is very, very fragile. When you touch, there is a food. Okay, this is a definitely will uh, result in the slow group of the fish and the rotten. The, the second photo, we can see the body uh, of the fish rotten and uh, the, the the, the third one is for the adverse, adverse bacteria infection. Uh, and the last is for no cardiac virus. If the, the liver is healthy, maybe let's chance to infect by the virus, by the bacteria, harmful bacteria. And for the poultry, I think when you uh, dissect your, your uh, chicken, you will 
fun sometimes. The first is for the toxin livers. If if you you feed too much antibiotics or you you feed uh, the feed contain the mycotoxin will damage the liver. Finally, will cause the toxin livers. Fact by the bacteria, which is a uh, salmonella, and uh, also vibrio hepatitis. And the fatty liver is very common. When you dissect, you will see the liver. And uh, some, uh, some chicken got the liver rupture. If the, the liver uh, uh, damage, so even you use the chemicals, you use the drug medicines, it will take a long time to recover and uh, easily uh, reoccur. That means, I, I mean, easily infect again by the pathogens. So another is for the swan. Okay, in China, we call rust land. When the liver not, not healthy, uh, I mean, when the liver or pig not healthy, we we'll call the rust land. You can see the first photo, the back of the pig got a land, we call rust land. And also the hair, not good. Bad hair, uh, eye pieces, I think. Uh, so the last photo, you can see the, uh, the, the eye pieces. The third photo is for the nutritional dairy for the pig lab. So that means the most probably is a liver problem. So what will happen if the uh, liver injured? Okay, the re I mean the, the, the bad result. Okay, the low feed intake. If unhealthy, subhealthy or funny animals, definitely the feed intake if we decrease. And the uh, ball with, with, with uh, vitality and uh, poor uh, anti stress ability, lower immunity. Of course, the, the, the family animal very big. If uh, the weather change, if the water change, they will infect by the pathogens that finally will cause the higher mortality. If not treated, immediately or properly. Once the, the, the liver damage, what are we, are we uh, going to do? Or how to repair or how to prevent? Okay, the last part is the uh, solutions. Because now in, in, uh, in the Farming industry, there are plenty of uh, animal health products like the phospholipid, protect the integrity of cell membranes, and uh, some chemicals, PPH, okay, which, which is a potassium, and the uh, Chinese herb. This year, I will, I will introduce a bit more because this year we, we totally banned the antibiotic in aquaculture. So, but uh, the harmful bacteria is still there. When you do the farming, the bacteria is there. Then how to control? This is a headache. This is a very headache for the farmers. So, good news is uh, we have a few product which can replace which can replace our uh, antibiotics like the essential oil, like the Chinese herb. Uh, in China, we use what kind of Chinese herb? Leaf rice, honeysuckle, and uh, silibum to improve the immune of the animals. Of course, now we also use a lot of bio acid because the animals, uh, due to overfeeding, the liver, liver problem, fatty liver, all this, we use a bio, bio acid to keep the liver healthy and uh, uh, keep the animal healthy too. Okay, what kind of bio acid we are using? Actually, it's mixture 
folic and, and uh, CBC, which is chemo dioxide, folic acid, folic acid, and uh, dioxide, folic acid. So mixture product, this is uh, uh, quite good. Okay, if you have uh, the fatty liver problem, if any your animal, farming animal got the liver problem, fatty liver, so you can try this product. Okay, uh, very mature and uh, uh, quite effective. Of course, we also use some uh, small molecular peptide to improve to protect the intestine to improve the immune of the animals. Of course, vitamin is the most uh, common product, especially vitamin C. When your animal uh, under stress, you can spray some vitamin C. In the market, they, they have, uh, this is, uh, there, there are plenty of such kind of uh, commercial product in the market. So if your animals, if you are facing such kind of problem, the intestine problem, liver problem, uh, you can try to look for from the market. Okay. I think uh, this is all our uh, sharing for today's topic. We just give the general information. If you want to details, uh, just leave the message or talk to contact our team. We will give you the, the answers according to your request. Okay, thank you. See you next time. Oh, thanks to our expert, Dr. Bai and uh, Dr. Zhangwei. And uh, if you uh, have any questions, uh, you can send an email to our the below uh, mailbox. And uh, also, if you want to uh, learn uh, who is Lachan School, and uh, you also can click our web, uh, website and uh, hope uh, in the future we have more topics to discuss with, uh, uh, with you. And uh, uh, if you want to learn, uh, we think uh, in China market, uh, you can send the email and the new message to us and uh, we will discuss with you online. And uh, okay, that's, that's of all. And uh, see you next time.